Travis Gilman in the red. Three minutes on the clock. Oh boy, I can't wait for this one. We've been speculating, wondering, is he ready for the hand fight in the young man Dayton Fix? And we'll find out right now in the red, Thomas Gilman. And two, three seconds three seconds. In, too much handsy to the face, as Mike Mal would say. Classic, you know, you see those head tap level change, Oklahoma State style. Hard left clubs. Hard clubs back and forth. Stick those feet, make your move. Fix comes in with a deep step and a fake. Not much of a reaction from Gilman. And a hard right-handed club from Thomas Gilman. And a come back with a hard club and underhook from Fix. Gilman able to clear, and this is going to be a physical one. Yeah, extremely. As you see, Dayton goes club to the right side, underhook, nothing there. So they're going to warn Gilman for passivity. First warning. Got to warn someone, and it's Gilman first. As Dayton standing there in the middle pretty well. Again, he tries to dig that underhook on the right side, his right side, and again, Gilman able to clear his left arm. Dayton wants to, or Gilman wants to be connected the whole time. He wants to be right here, pulling, snapping. Dayton's gonna come in, hand fight for a little bit, snap, snap off, and work again from space. He's not gonna hang in there for an extended period of time if he can help it. Now getting more to his ties is Thomas Gilman. Head taps, back to that club. And they're gonna warn Fix, that's confirmed. Dayton Fix war for passivity. Next guy going on the shot clock. So you gotta do what you can here to impress the judges, if you will. Control the center of the mat, take more attacks. Neither guy able to get to a leg as of yet. The threats from Dayton, a lot of level changes, hadn't pulled the trigger. Either has Thomas Gilman. Gilman not typically a fake guy, but when he fires his single, it's true. And now Thomas Gilman gonna be going on the shot clock, put 30 up there. And now he goes to his underhook right side. That's it, hard fake. See, he's filling you, come on, Bubba. They are hard clubs. We're mat side with headsets on, and I can hear the, the, the hand hit the back of the head. And Dayton, only 20 years old, just finished his redshirt year, but clearly can Hard stand snap. in there in the middle and withstand at least one period of Gilman's hand fighting. And there's the point for Dayton Fix. He strikes first, but that's just the one. Not likely going to be enough to win this match, but could put him at the lead at the break. And it very well could give Gilman an opportunity to put Fix on the shot that's clock right, in the right, second. Right, nice and there single. we see wow. single to a double. Takedown for Dayton, excuse me, Thomas Gilman. Dayton Fix wrestling through this position. And he's gonna try for a reversal. And there's two for Gilman, a little cross up. And he's on top, it's his position. He's great here. Fix going to work. He's gonna try to go on the opposite side. Open up, side. open up. Oh, making. Gilman's got his hands locked in front of his face. It's, they're gonna let the time run out. It's interesting that they went one and then the two. I thought we might see just a straight, oh no, he had the shot clock point. So three, two, two, fix after one. Unbelievable little counter there by Dayton. And, and Gilman's shot, man, so quick. There's no opportunity to defend there from Fix, but he wrestled through the position, found a way to score. Awesome, because normally the guy gets taken down, you just go into defensive mode. He said, no, I'm wrestling from the bottom. Came around, able to like catch an ankle, scoot his hips out, turn that into a crotch lock position, and roll it through for two. 3-2, Dayton Fix leads as we head into the second period. Curious to see if Gilman's gonna kind of force the positional issue and get Dayton on the clock to get that criteria advantage, 3-3, or if he's just gonna continue to go hard, try to get another leg attack takedown. As you saw, that single to Dayton's, um, Dayton's right leg was true. And it was, it was like Dayton's right leg, but he got all the way behind it him was and like catch both at the same time. Yeah, kind of a sweet double there. Trying to push him towards the edge is Gilman. And Gilman body gets lock. to a body lock. Dayton with overs. They're going to be grounded as they hear near Get the edge. Oh, they're going to say one blue. One blue, and white car, white paddled by both. Judge and chair both say so out of bounds. 3-2, no change, fix with the lead. 2.22 to go in the bout. And 
the official, Matt official, Zach Aaron indicating towards Fix. So, Fix very well go back on the clock now. Go on the clock for the first time. Blue offered and confirmed by the chair, not judge. There we go. So Fix on the shot clock now, 30 seconds of no scoring and we'll have a 3-3 Gilman lead. And there's a sweep single leg. Good sprawl from Thomas Gilman. 155 to go in the second period. Shot clock at 10 seconds, 20 to go. Collar and underhook, nice control tie here for Thomas Gilman. Gilman planted in the center, marching forward. Fix, not, not a whole lot of urgency to score. He's gonna need to earn a score either way. Yeah, it doesn't have to be in this activity period necessarily. And there it is, 3-3, Gilman in the lead. Last score criteria is what has him in the lead there. No cautions. Both have a two and a one. So now we'll see, now that Dayton's gotta go, what's gonna be his go-to leg attack? What's gonna be his way to force a flurry and get an opportunity to score? There's a shot. High crotch to the leg, but not through. It doesn't get to the hip, really. One minute. Three, three, I don't care who wins, go. but I do I would like to see this one go three. I know, right? Oh, nice shot, shot from space by Fix. We'll see if he gets an opportunity to go to uh, his inside trip. Ooh. And looking to step in there is Fix. Of course, he's got that great inside trip, kind of reaching between the legs there is Gilman. He's got him in the zone, and there's gonna be one more. So Fix, a more or less irrelevant point, because if Fix gets one here, he's back, he's in the lead. But still a point nonetheless, and showing a control in the center, 25 to go. Thomas Gilman, it's a shot. Good sprawl. He gets himself away, underhook for Gilman, less than 20 to go. That overhook, that's the side where, Gil, where Fix can inside trip, inside trip, but not going to get it. Goes to a seatbelt. Look at the car wheel. He catches them, and they're going to give him two Take and make it a 6-3 with five seconds to go. Match number one going to go to Iowa's Thomas Gilman. Wow. First match is over. Gilman wins 6-3. Fix able to go with him, though. We'll see it again.